let's talk about maple syrup urine disease. Maple syrup urine disease is a rare disorder in which the child's body cannot metabolize or break down amino acids. Well, what are amino acids? Amino acids are the molecules that the body uses to make proteins. Maple syrup urine disease is caused by a deficiency in branch chain alpha keto acid dehydrogenase, which is the enzyme that the body uses to break down those amino acids. MSUD is congenital, meaning that it is present at birth. It's also autosomal recessive in inheritance. This means that both parents must carry the mutated gene in order for the baby to be born with MSUD. Maple syrup urine disease is diagnosed by testing the blood for the following amino acids, leucine, isoleucine, and valine. This blood test can be done when completing the heel stick test for PKU. Let's go over some symptoms that we may see in a child with maple syrup urine disease. Symptoms of MSUD occur very early after the child is born. During the first week of life, the child may have problems feeding, the child may also have neurological symptoms such as seizures, muscle spasms, unusual muscle movements, and muscle tightness. The child's urine, sweat, and earwax will have a distinctive odor of maple syrup. The child may sleep often and have a low energy level. Other symptoms include vomiting, irritability, and headaches. Treatment of MSUD is dietary and must be started within 12 days of the baby being born for treatment to be successful. The child is fed a special formula that is low in branch chain amino acids. This special diet must be continued for the remainder of the child's life. Some prominent nursing interventions of the nurse caring for the child with maple syrup urine disease may include implementing seizure precautions, monitoring electrolyte levels related to vomiting. This may also require electrolyte replacement since electrolyte loss may occur as a result of vomiting. We should also monitor intake and output and prevent infection. In children with maple syrup urine disease, an infection could lead to a metabolic crisis or brain damage. All right, everyone, I hope that this video was helpful. Be sure to visit nursingtonurture.com for promo codes, merch, as well as more educational content. Remember to never give up, and as always, thanks for watching.